Hi guys, so today I have a haul for you. The first half will probably be filmed in here, the second half um, up in my boyfriend's room because um, I left my hat up there yesterday, so we'll get to that in a second. The first place, place is Walmart, and yes, I know what you're thinking, Walmart, really? Okay, so the first thing I got, which I've been needing because for work um, we have to tuck our shirts in and you have to wear a belt, and all my belts work, but they don't look very nice. Um, so I ended up getting this brown braided belt. Um, it just has this gold buckle. I mean, nothing too exciting, but I do like these um, braided because you can hook it in wherever. Um, and because jeans hit me in different places on my waist and different things like that. So this is nice because you don't have to worry about those holes. And I'm pretty sure this is like $10, but this is just a need. Um... Or is becoming a need, I guess. It wasn't technically a need yet. Uh, but my other brown belt was breaking. Um, the other thing I got, which are just cotton balls. Jumbo size cotton balls. Because I use them when I wash my face and when I do my nails. Um, so yeah, I just got some of those. Um, I didn't realize these were the jumbo ones. I've never bought cotton balls before. Um, I've always just had them. So this was a new experience. And I didn't know these were jumbo. Looked at them and they were like, these are not jumbo. They're like, I don't know, they should remind me of regular cotton balls. See? Can you see that? That little one floating around? Yeah. I don't know. But this was like a couple dollars. But I just thought I would show you. The last thing I'm going to show you right now. The last thing I'm going to show you right now is this scarf. Which again... I have a plain black one, but I wanted one that had like gray and like darker colors. So it brought interest to an outfit and not just warmth like my black one does. Um, and this is just a regular scarf, I would say, um, with this gray, dark gray and lighter gray zebra type pattern. And then with black um, tassels, I guess, at the end. And it is pretty thick. I'll show you how wide it is. Um... It's very wide, and you can't, I don't think you can, see through it. You might be able to see through it a little bit, but it is very warm. I wore it yesterday, and it was pretty cold outside. Um, so, yeah, this is the scarf I got, which I've already worn it. And you will also see that in an outfit of the day coming up, because um, I'm pretty sure this will be up before the outfit of the day. Because I wore my brown belt in an outfit and I wore this in an outfit. So these are kind of pieces that um, I'm needing right now are more accessories or stuff like this that enhances an outfit, not necessarily clothing um, wise. So yes, this is that. So the other half will be up soon. Bye! Hi guys, so this is the second half of the haul. Um, it's probably just going to be right after that, so I'll just continue. The hat that I was talking about is this hat right here. Um, it is 100% wool. And it's just a one size fits all hat. Um, it just kind of looks like that, I guess. Um, it is very warm. I wore it the other day in an outfit of the day. Um, and the all, it just has this black thing, and then it also has. Um, this extra little, a little exciting detail. It's supposed to be on the side of your hat. Um, this hat is from Walmart, and it's about ten dollars. I, I'm pretty sure it was about ten dollars. So yeah, I'm not a big hat person. I've been trying to get more accessories, like I said, um, and so I thought, you know, maybe I like hats. So I wore this a couple times. Sometimes I don't know how I feel about ha hats yet. Okay, so the next thing. From my haul is I don't think I officially showed it in a haul, so I'll go ahead and show it now. Um, I showed it in my color, my hair color change video. Um, it is just this purse from Target, um, just this brown purse with this gold detailing right here. Um, it actually matches the boots I got from Target um, really nicely. Um, they both have these silver um, or gold sorry buckles on them and it just looks like this 
you open it up and there is a zipper pouch there's stuff all, all up in this a zipper pouch right here a big container and then there's um, two little pockets in there as well for you to put things and I just like it um, it keeps its shape really nicely um, cause I put it in lockers and just everywhere and it's just it's held up really well considering where it's all it's been through just in the short amount of time um, so yeah that's a good thing the next place I never order online to be honest with you I just never have and I did and I ordered from Sephora um, there is not a Sephora or an Ulta or anything like that near me um, yeah I like I think Walgreens Walmart Target Dylan's is where we're getting um, that's about it so I have been wanting a lot of my products are older and they're starting to get really used up especially the eyeshadows um, and I've had the same colors for a long time and I really wanted to um, change but I don't want to spend a lot of money on some eyeshadows that I don't know if I even like the colors or what the colors will look like on my skin um, and stuff like that I like having palettes and choices um, of really different colors um, so yeah we'll get to we'll save the palette for the last thing I got we'll start with the samples first over there this first one is by Ren and it is a radiance renewal mask just yeah. um, the next one is bubble and bu bumble and bubble um, grooming cream hair grooming cream I just tried products that I never tried before or I've been stuck in the same rut um, the next one I got is Amazing Cosmetics Anti-Aging Face Primer. Um, and I only have had one face primer and I'm not very consistent with using it. Um, eyelid primer, use all the time. Face primer, have a hard time using. So those are the three samples I chose. Um, you always get a three, pick three samples. Um, the next thing, oh well. The next thing came with a code. Um, you just type in the code and it is the blemish buster by Clinique just comes like this um, in this tiny bottle I haven't used this I haven't used this yet so yes that came with it for free just like a little trial size and if you're wondering what's on my nails, I did not get this with this. Um, it is the Chrome Love My Nails in Envy. And it's just this green color that's been on my nails. Finally was able to redo them. Okay, so the things I actually paid money for um, is this Sephora Light Touch Highlighter. And I've never even been into a Sephora, so I had no idea. Um, you had to get over $50 for free shipping, because um, it was going to be more with what I got. So I just went to the sale and tried to pick something that I've never used before. And a highlighter is definitely something I have never used before. Um, I just got it in this color. It really blends out nicely. Um, so, yeah. It doesn't... It shows up this color at first, but I blend it in really well, and you can't tell. I did my eyeshadow kind of in weird lighting, so I apologize. It's looking kind of strange. Um, so yeah. The other thing I got, so this is, so the reason I got it, like I said before, is for the, um, the size, the options, um, and I don't have a problem with eyeshadow staying on my eyes especially if I prime them like I use the elf primer I'm pretty sure it was like the dollar one um it's not even the mineral one it's just the elf primer and I have no problem with eyeshadow staying on my eyes um at all so what I got is the 
Sephora Makeup Studio. It tells me it's a $440 value. Um, do I believe it? Not necessarily. But this is the box it came in. And then I'll show you what it looks like on the outside. This glare is like horrible. Okay, well, since it's glaring, I'm going to switch um, cameras. And I will see you guys in a second. Hi guys, so this is the Sephora Makeup Studio. I tried to put it in a light that you could see um, and it's not glaring, so we'll hope this works out. Okay, here it goes. Okay, so this is what it looks like. Um, I don't know how big my hand is, but it's about the size of my hand. It's a lot bigger than I actually thought it would be. Um, it just comes in a black um, box. And then Sephora is written right here. You can see it. I'm, I know there's like a huge glare. Um, there. I don't know what's better. Okay, we'll just open it up. So first you can open up. I don't know how I'm going to do this. So first you open up. Let's go ahead and open up. Okay, so these bottom right here have some brushes that they come with on either side. And these three are blushes right here. And then there's a bronzer. And these two, these three actually have shimmers in them. Um, you can kind of, you're randomly seeing them. Um, if you get really close, I think you can see them. See how they're kind of shimmery? Um, and I really like these because they all have a wide variety of colors. Um, which is kind of what I'm looking for because right now I only have one. Um, I think I have like two blushes. Which obviously does not give me a variety of colors. So at least this I can see which ones look good on my skin. It also comes with cream, eyeliners, eyeshadows. Um, right here. In some really cool colors. And then base, a basic black and brown. There's a gray and another type of brown color. Darker. And then there's two just eyeliner pencils. I'll open one up for you. That just look like that. I did use one. I used both of these actually this morning. Um, they're just the black eyeliner pencil. And then there's one. There's one in brown, and then the mascara, which I also have on today. Um, now we get to the eyeshadows, which these are is the variety of eyeshadows it comes with. So it has a lot of bright colors over more on this side and darker, deeper fall colors on this side. Um, and then just kind of basic um, colors around here. Um, there's like two white ones at the corners, which is nice, and some lighter ones, which is really nice actually for, because um, I always seem to run out of those colors first. Sorry, this is not the best counter to do this on. Okay. So you open it up. It's like more layers. And these are the eyeshadows. This is the last row of the eyeshadows from here to here is all lip glosses or um, lipsticks. I guess they'd be lip glosses because they're more glossy. Um, I did try this one on today. Um, so yeah, there's just all these fun colors with this, which I was super excited about because along with the color, I have chapsticks um, and shimmery colors, but not a lot of just random fun colors. Um, so I'm excited to see what these colors look like um, on my skin. And if I like it, I would get a full size like lipstick of it. This was um, for mainly just experimenting and like trying out which ones I'd like. And then getting um, a full, a bigger size of that when I was done with this. Because um, obviously there's a lot in here. Um, and But I really like that. And I don't think the quality is that bad. I heard because they come out with these every year. Here's that one. Um, the white one. 
over here. We'll do this green one. So the, it doesn't seem like when you swatch them at least, um, they all are pretty bright colors. And the lip, these are a little sticky if you are not, if you do not like sticky things at all. I would probably not tell you to get this, but it's just when it comes out it's sticky, not um, once it is out, or once it's on your lips it's fine. Um, for me, I don't think it's very sticky. And what I really like is this mirror. I don't know if you will. Hi. I really like that it looks like it can light up. It doesn't, but these like... I don't know. I just really like that detailing on it. I know I'm quite strange. Um, but this is kind of an overview of what all it comes with, um, which is nice. And it's $49.95, I'm pretty sure. Um, it's a little less than $50, so I had to buy another thing to get free shipping. And it's a pretty big palette and just a range of things. If you're wanting to try something out, um, just different colors out. I would definitely recommend this. If you know what colors you like, I probably wouldn't because you probably will not use um, half of this palette. But if you are just trying to figure out what colors you like and just um, all kinds of different things, try out different things, then I would definitely recommend this palette to you. Um, it just depends on where you are in your makeup collection. Because um, I would go to the store and I'd be like, I don't know what color... I want, I just would get all, you know, just not know what color to get. And so I'm really excited about this. Um, I do keep the plastic on there. Um, so I am excited about this just because of all the variety and everything that it comes with. That is an overview. If you want a more in-depth review, let me know um, in the comments below. And yeah. So yeah, that is my haul from Walmart and Sephora. I hope you liked it. And if you recommend anything from Sephora, let me know in the comments. And there is a coupon for 20% off online orders from Sephora on a site called Slick Deals. Um, I think it's .com. I'm not positive about that. Um, but it doesn't start till November 2nd. So I thought I would tell you because that's coming up for Christmas or if you don't live by one, even if you do, you get 20% off, you know, who doesn't like that? Um, I will have slick deals linked down below when I figure out what exactly the dot is and don't forget to comment, subscribe, and let me know what you think and have a great day. Bye!